Two years after her husband's unexpected death, Bobby Thomas is making an emotional return to the Today Show studio. The Today Style editor of 15 Years had a teary-eyed reunion with anchors Hoda Kotb and Jenna Bush Hager on Thursday, offering an update on life since her husband died at the age of 42 in December 2020. She said that so many wonderful people have reached out to her, including Kimberly Schlappman from the band Little Big Town. Schlappman's first husband Stephen Rhodes died from a heart attack in 2005. Never in a million years did I think a country star would reach out to offer comfort, she said, adding that she and Schlappman bonded over feeling a lack of physical touch in their lives after their husband's deaths. She said Schlappman recommended booking a massage to help cope with this aspect of grief. That was such a good tip for me, she said. Inspired by the messages she's received from viewers since her husband's death, Thomas also announced she'll be hosting a new Today project called Dear Bobby, in which she will weigh in on submissions from viewers about their life challenges. Thomas also shared her complicated feelings about returning to the Today studio in an essay published by the outlet Wednesday. I've walked into Studio 1A more than a thousand times, yet my knees already feel weak when I think about stepping back inside, she wrote. It makes no sense, as I have never known such support as the support I received from my Today family. Maybe that's it. Maybe it's because I know the moment Jenna squeezes my hand or Hoda, with her huge heart, looks at me and says it's okay, I will be exposed all over again. We were so deeply bound, today contributor Bobby Thomas reflects on mourning her husband she added that sharing her experience with others has. But when I'm talking about it or helping someone else navigate theirs, it gets lighter. I feel better when I'm working to help others feel better. That's my version of self-care and what brings me joy. It gives me purpose. Thomas' husband Marion died after spending five weeks in the ICU fighting a bacterial infection that caused his organs to fail. He suffered an ischemic stroke a year earlier, but today reports his death was unrelated to the stroke. I don't need to be told there was a silver lining or a bigger reason, there isn't. And that is okay for me to feel. Thomas told Today co-host, Hoda Kotb, in an interview aired in June 2021. I have gratitude for being loved. Thomas shared a photo of her and Kotb on Instagram at the time hugging, saying she hopes her story may help others in mourning feel less alone.